area that I'd like to talk about is the dashboards. Now, this is where we visualize a lot of the information that's been collected in the system. And I'll talk a little bit more about data collection in a moment. Dashboards are a quick and easy way of adding different dashlets, as we call them, dashboard components, uh, to visualize uh, either individual metrics, as we're looking at here. So this graph in the top left and the bottom right corner, just showing single metrics on single hosts. It could be a history of events that have happened. So rather than current information, we can see where we've had failures and recoveries of different, uh, different checks that we're running. In the bottom left corner here, we've got top services by metric. So you can uh, rank things by top 10, top 25, etc. So you can see perhaps the most used disks or the busiest CPUs, the busiest network links. So it's a quick way to visualize the, the hotspots in your network. And all of these dashboards are completely configurable uh, by individual users. And we can create dashboards that we can share with other users as a gold standard as well. So I, as a user, could perhaps have this data center view which has been shared with me. I can see from the lock icon that I'm not able to change this myself because it's been shared with me read only. Um, I've shared this dashboard over here with other users because I can see the sharing icon there. So this is showing our flow monitoring which I'll come back to shortly um, and the other dashboards are just my own individual dashboards. I can add new dashboards very easily in different layouts. So I can choose maybe I want one or two columns I can then use the drawer on the left hand side here to add in the different components that I want to visualize. And I can then configure those once I've dragged them in to show exactly the information that I want. One of the things that you can see here as well is the hashtag list that we have. That's a way of tagging objects in our monitoring system to show us a view across the whole environment. So perhaps I want to see all of my Linux servers and how they're doing, or maybe I want to see everything in AWS. Maybe I've tagged uh, devices and services and so on uh, for one of my end customers and I'd like to see those. Hashtags will solve those problems for you. We can tag any host and any service in the system with a tag and we can tag as many, uh, we can use as many tags as we like. And that then allows us to drag out this traffic light view just into a, a single color icon that shows me is everything good? Is it in a warning critical state and so on? So this is always showing me the worst state, the most severe problem uh, in any of those hashtags. So all of these are okay at the moment, but if we scroll down here, you can see we've got uh, our interfaces. So that could be our network monitoring. You can see we've got some critical interfaces. We've got some critical issues uh, in London, uh, but all of our MySQL databases and so on are operational. So it's a really nice way of pulling out specific information, regardless of where those devices are, uh, and it will bring it all into that single view. Hashtags also are used in other parts of the product. So for example, when I'm creating roles for users to log in with, I can grant people access to see and do things with particular hashtags. So rather than having to worry about selecting hosts and services that I know that user uh, or a set of users might want to see, this way I could tag all of a customer's devices and then give those customers access through that tag. So just make sure that they only ever see the hosts and the services that they expect to and that we want them to. On the other side of the system with the reporting where we're getting the data back out once we've collected it, uh, the same is also true. A lot of our reports are based on hashtags or the business service monitoring that we've already looked at. So by setting up your hashtags, you're then able to run perhaps an SLA report or a performance report against a particular customer, against a particular device type or geography, whatever hashtags you've applied. Um, so a really important part of the system, really powerful, allows you to drive a lot of different bits of functionality uh, all based on these hashtags.